traveling to Tanzania and Masama Girls Secondary School, I had participated in fundraising events to support an earlier mission trip. When that group of sojourners returned, I was impressed by their stories of the work going on at Masama and loved seeing the photos of Masama students and staff alongside my St. Matthew's friends. But it was not until the summer of 2019 that I was able to feel and truly see the importance of the mission of Masama Girls School. The energy of the students and their excitement for learning was impressive, especially considering their rustic dormitories, limited technology, and separation from their families. The girls were very grateful for the opportunity to study at Masama and had a clear understanding of the importance of getting an education. They were fully aware that the education they were getting at Masama was the stepping stone for a better life for themselves, their families, and their communities. Many of the older students expressed a desire to go to college to become doctors, educators, or scientists. I was especially touched by how happy, positive, and inquisitive and supportive of each other these young girls were. Every day we could hear joy in their voices and see it on their faces as they went about their daily activities. I often think of a particular girl who stood out to me. I will always remember her beautiful smile and engaging voice. I found myself next to her one day on the dirt moving detail. <laughs> And as we worked side by side, passing buckets of dirt and singing a Lutheridge song taught to us by Daniel and Andrew Nichols, she told me of her dream. No, it was actually her plan to one day become a doctor. She knew the path she had to travel to achieve that goal and knew that it would not be easy and that she would have to work very hard. She spoke of wanting to give back because of how much she had been fortunate enough to be in the school. My young friend's name is Hope. We exchanged a few letters after our mission trip, but have since lost touch as she has graduated and is no longer at Masama. I hope and pray that Hope has continued to pursue her plan of continued education and service. And I know that others like Hope will realize their dreams as St. Matthews continues to support Masama Girls School.